Hey, 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 Uncle Mark in the Mothership. Three string cigar box guitar. Leonard Skinner, Gimme Back My Bullets. Song is fantastic. I love the album. The whole album was good. Uh, I remember buying it. So uh, this song is super easy. It's got four chords in it. An open G, an A, a C, and a D. And I'm going to play some of the song now, the first verse and the chorus, and then I'll break down exactly what I'm doing. Two, three, four. Life is so strange, just changing, yes indeed. Well, I've seen the hard times and the pressure's been on me. really great song so what do we got G D G 42 34 24 those are my gauges they're wound and they are electric guitar strings um, I'm playing through a Roland mini cube and I'm on battery power and I'll show you those settings at the end of the video like I said before the song has four chords in it one of them is open G so there's your open G G sharp and A a is the key to this song. So if you want to play this song, you, have, you play it in A. Uh, something about the album version and the live version. The album version is really a toss-up between G sharp and A. It's somewhere in between. It's a producer's trick to turn things around. But if you listen to the live at Nebworth 76, it's an A. They played it in A. They're just using producer tricks because it's a little bit flat off of the A. So just letting you know that if you try to play along with the album, you're going to feel like you're out of tune. So either tune to the album or listen to the live at Nebworth, uh, the 76, or, or any of the live stuff. They'll play it in A. So B flat B and C. C is a bar chord just like A was and it's here on the fifth fret. C sharp and D. Okay and that is right there on that seventh fret and that dot. So you're basically open second fret C on the fifth fret D right here. And when you toggle back and forth it's really nice to use these two fingers so if you're a, hop up to C, then go to D, then go to A. So you're only doing one big hop instead of a hop and a hop and a hop back. So you're kind of toggling back and forth between these two fingers. That's really a, a smart way to play. So A. Life is so C, D, A. Second fret C, D on the seventh, A, C, D, A, A, C, D, A, give me back my bullets, A, D, put them back C where they belong, A, D, back my bullets okay so that's the whole song if you need a little fine tuning then the best thing to do would be to kind of listen to the album and listen to what's going on um, it, it's a just an easy really easy song to pick up if you just know where these chords are okay so the <laughs> That little, give me back my bullets, that's a trick that 
you're basically putting your finger in this second position, which in, in the second position, it means your first finger is in the second fret. There you go. And that's just like A. Okay? So this finger plays all notes in third fret. This ring finger here plays all the notes in that fret. And the pinky plays the notes in that fifth fret. So that's how it works. And you're going to play these outside strings. So you're... Like so. So you're mimicking the Gimme Back My Bullets. Gimme Back My Bullets. Or Gimme Back My Bullets. And that's what you're doing is mimicking the vocal part. It's either way you do that is fine. The Gimme Back My Bullets. So that's that little trick, and they do it in the beginning, too, though. So this is definitely hard. It's not uh, something that beginners can instantly pick up on. But I want you to give it a go, because getting this on this stretch is really important in playing Leonard Skinner and classic rock. It's not necessary. You can certainly give me back my bullets. Just play it with one finger if you want, but these extra things, the right, that's a wonderful little, a little touch that I kind of added to this song because in some places this song might get boring to you if you are a you know a, a higher level guitar player and this just adds a flourish and I like adding flourishes this is a basic blues box okay with our A here that's on the D string at the seventh fret and what I'm gonna do is bend this D about that reach. So I want to bend this string just about to that one. Just like so, right? And I want to bend up, down, and I want to cry on this one. It's not as big a bend. And I want to land on that A. And this is a move you're going to see a lot in classic rock, especially southern rock. The, uh, right? And you can add those pinch harmonics, right? If you feel like it. And pinch harmonics are something I haven't really gotten into yet, but if you know it and can do it, it really is a nice touch with the... Uh, really nice to add those pinch harmonics if you can or not but that's where you want to be is this little blues box and like I said we talked about you know with here being in the second position there and here you're in the fifth position because you've come up five first second third fourth and fifth and everything is played right here with these three and here are your notes D C and A and if you notice, I always turn my hand a little bit because I'm always driving these notes up this way as opposed to just sitting on them flat and going... I'm driving them up. I'm going to drive that train into that next note. So that's something. With this one, I pull and wiggle here. Like so, and you'll see my neck move a little bit to get those wiggles. Right? And I always like pulling off. But you know, you don't need to do any of that stuff. You can just sit here and go, Life is so strange, yes, it's changing, yes, indeed. I've seen those hard times, and the pressure's been on me. Just one strong. I keep on. The working man can do And I got my act together Gonna walk all over you 
give me back my bullets. D. Put them back to see where they belong. D. Ain't fooling C. Open G. It's that simple. It's very fun. The core, uh, the uh, jam, just works with D and C. So that's how the jam works. And you'll you'll find that, and it's very fun. The song is very short, by Leonard Skinner's standards. It's about comes in at about four minutes long, a little less. So it is a short song by Leonard Skinner's standards, but uh, just a fun, fun tune, and uh, you're going to really enjoy it. This is Uncle Mark in the Mothership. Thank you so much for everything you do for me. I really do appreciate it. And uh, I got Uncle Mark t-shirts. See, You can maybe see on the back there. Kind of trying to pull it around. But uh, there's nothing on the front, so you don't have to be advertising anything. I kind of like that, just to have a plain black shirt. You're going to wear a suit or something like that. You can wear a T-shirt. I really do like that. And uh, I thank you so much for all of your uh, support. I really appreciate it. Also, uh, T-shirt links are down below in the show notes. And uh, I also have some donation links down in the show notes. And I uh, PayPal and Square, they're both safe and secure. A buck a show is all we ask. And uh, I wanted to show you real fast that you can put a slide on and do this song. So there's A, C, and D. That is so strange. Just changing is me. Right? <laughs> so, you know, it's it's a simple song to play with a slide as well. So uh, so let me show you what I'm using for my uh, So like I said, I'm on battery on this Roland Cube and uh, I'm on that Brit combo. My gain is pretty high up there. You know, I'm gonna you know, I'm pretty high on my gain. So, uh, just to show you that, also my guitar is dimed, uh, volume-wise and tone, and my tone here is dimed, and I have a little bit of reverb. I'm like on that third notch there. So, uh, that gives you an idea of where I'm, where I'm at. Thank you so much for everything you do for me, really. Please subscribe. Tell your friends about the channel. We're doing lots of fun things. Um, things coming up. Um, I have a website I'm, la I'm launching, and uh, that's going to be really cool, and it's taken up a lot of my time, so uh, trying to do a website myself, I'm not very tech friendly. I'm more a creator than I am a tech guy. So uh, working on that. Thank you so much for everything and really appreciate it. And listen to more Leonard Skinner. It really helps. See you later. <laughs>